welcome to another edition of Box Busters. I'm Brian Fletcher. He's Chris Olds. This is 2011 Topps Allen and Ginter. It is live and already priced on Beckett.com. Look at you, ahead of the game. Look at that. Well, not really. I the know. boxes are. The product's been out for about <laughs> a couple of weeks now. No, <laughs> not that interesting. But be, be forewarned that, that, that this card does not exist. Yeah, I was going to say, yeah. that allows you to talk more about what's crazy selling in this there stuff. There you go. The Manny Pacquiao stuff is selling. Even the base cards were selling. Crazy. A thousand bucks for the autograph. Yeah. It's so crazy. A lot of, lot of, a decent amount of redemptions for the autographs. but Too many. Um, too yeah. Many. I'll say it. And the uh, relic checklist, I believe, we were talking about 60 ish. No, it's up to, it's more like 189. Some guys have. That's what happens when you get three hits per box. Yeah, yeah. And there's a lot of boxes that are three three jerseys or bats. Yep. So. We've got uh, twenty. We've got twenty four packs. Is that what it is? What are we looking at? I believe so. Twenty four packs. Eight somewhere. cards per pack. It does. So. It's box been stoppers as usual. Popular. This is an N forty three. You got I the got monster the cabinet. cabinet. And the checklist. Checklist so with every. The, right here is the. Check out that relic checklist. The entire back page, essentially. And that's not even it because I had to add about name 20 ones. guys that had bat and jersey cards. Yep. So yep. they just list them once there. Geronimo, on the back. Napoleon Bonaparte. Well, those are, those are DNA relics. Yeah. Those Edgar are Allen one Bosa. Of one hair cards. Oh. Mm. Exclusively hair or any other hair. DNA? Hair. Just hair, sir. Here's the Go National ahead. Parks. Uh, Abraham Lincoln and I don't know who that is. I can't. Cons, Connes, C O N N E S S. Maybe I should know how to say that guy's name. Say in the back. John Connes. There we go. Somebody. John Connes. I got right, an N forty three. That's it's all right, but the player is probably not as strong as on the checklist. Adam Wainwright. Okay. A lot of big names. That's not the one I would have wanted. But, <laughs> you know, that's why there's several on that checklist. <clears throat> all right, here we go. I just got out of the hundred and twenty five degree Texas heat. Yeah. Yeah. After a three o'clock lunch to discover this feast. It's a Dustin Pedroia base card. Base cards are, you know, kind of similar to last or previous issues. Yeah, they're different in that they have logos on them this year, though. That's oh, the first time. That, uh, first time Ginter's gone that direction. Say hometown heroes insert as well. From Spring, Nick Texas. Swisher is one of Josh Spring. Beckett. No relation. Out near Houston. Yep. Out near Houston. Fortress of Penultimacy Mini. Is this Mike Gellner? If I knew the what the word guy? penultimacy meant, yeah. I could tell you what that sets about. Well, one thing we were talking about is that a lot of these mini, of course, they have a lot of the crazy minis and stuff. A lot of them aren't selling as well as they have yep. in the past. Now, the super short print, printed ones, the one for case, two for case, yeah, those are selling. But you're just generic, kind of like these. People are over some of the yeah, other sports. They're a dollar card, dollar yeah. twenty-five, and that's probably being a little generous. The design on this this set in particular actually is not bad. The um, what's it called? Step right up. Carnival showcase minis. How about the human blockhead there? I've been called that before. Not really, but some of the inserts have also taken over in the large card area. How about a yeah, famous ship set? Yeah, the floating fortresses. Yeah. I just got one too. The HMS Revenge. Cool name for a ship. I don't know about for an insert card though. Here yeah, is the world's different. most mysterious figures, Nostradamus. Nostro what? Nostro, Nostro what? Did he predict that he was going to be in a box of top <laughs> trading cards? <laughs> we'll have to go back and look. A lot go, of, uh, go ahead. Yeah, sorry. <clears throat> Excuse me, another insert. The Ascent of Man. I smell that. There you go. That's kind of, never mind. Oh, no. Ascent of Man, I got it. It took me a second. It's the end of the day. It's, it's a hot weather joke. So, through. is that an <clears throat> evolution? Yes. Yeah, yes, and it's a giant it's puzzle, a, right? Yes, it's a giant painting made up of several cards that show the evolution of man. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, again, not not selling particularly with dollar dollar twenty five. For Olympic them, champion Sonia Richards. And my first relic. I'm gonna guess three eight as far as a price. The but typical range. Yeah, that. Tim Hudson for your yeah. typical common. I wouldn't be unhappy with that. But former it's, Oakland A. You know. Current, but it's he's he's a brave there. So. I know. I know. Uh, the the uh, Ginter code parallels this year oh, are yeah, all over the place, and they're subtle, if you can tell by the corners of that card. Double check. What it means, no. only a select few will figure <clears throat> out. Because one of the more interesting insert sets, which is not was not previously announced when it was released, the fabulous face fucking. What is it? Flocculence. I knew I was going to have a. a this there. video just became a YouTube <laughs> hit. <laughs> yeah. Fabulous face flocculence cards. Flocculence. I got a burn signs. Yeah, burn sides side burns uh. card. 
I was trying not to say a certain word when I said flocculence. Flocculence? No. Uh, a little short. <laughs> Her autographs and relics are selling well. Yeah, there are. This year's checklist for autographs is is probably not as wacky as the recent yeah. past. Um, it's mostly traditional athletes from traditional sports. Um, decent amount of baseball players, as usual. A very small number of other autograph subjects. So it's it seems stronger to me. Yep. They're one. also tougher to pull, though. One in one sixty eight. Yeah. Or one in sixty eight. Here's a black border mini. Sorry, Chris. No, it's all good. This is gonna take a while. I'm, I'm yeah, slow I see. I was about to say you need to get a get a get on it there. Cheryl Burke, Dancing with the Stars. There was no segue between know. that statement. Yes. Yeah. To me. And sorry, I'm distracted by your. Tim yeah, he, he couldn't concentrate there. <laughs> Tim Howard, U.S. U.S. National Team goalie. Hope solo autographs as well. Yep. Exchange cards though. Dude. How about Guy Fieri? Yeah, there's another. Well, and Balud. I don't know. His Daniel first name. Balud. I'll take give, the Balud give us the, card. Give us the foodie rundown. Uh, well, a bunch of restaurants in New York. For also, Balud. the host of Minute to Win It. Yes, I can probably do without Guy Fieri. Me too. <laughs> I think I think so too. I, I'm not. I do watch. I do his watch, haircut is a bit 1990s. I do watch Guy who's so. driving his eyes. And you know what? His autograph is uh, the best-selling yeah. one of the chefs. Who? Now he's, Fieri? Uh, yeah, he's probably his name right. he's the most popular of the three. So Bourdain is not in this, though. Unfortunately, not. That is a tragedy. Maybe next me. year, Clay. Come on, next year. Ooh, call Anthony him Bourdain. out. Not. Woo. Please, I'm asking nicely. I, I am I'm too. Ask. I'm asking. No Thanks. reservations. I just want a Nick Swisher. I've written about that a few times. How about a royal wedding card as part of the base set? There we go. Yeah. That one actually selling. I mean, for a base card. Yeah. That, above a common. A premium yes. level there. Yes, above a common. Yeah, there aren't that many inclusions that are unusual. There's some wacky texture going on there. And I got two no, notable... Wins with the table. Yeah. I got two notable base cards in this one. A George W. Bush. Unannounced autograph. Yep, he has autographs. They're about what three, three fifty. They yeah, hitting. and they're live too. So yeah. they're they're selling really well. Tell and me about that one, Brian. That mini that you just put up. Oh, that is an uninvited guests mini. It's Haunted some axe faces. murders or axe murder house. The patch cards in Goodwin. Mm -hmm. We've got animals in peril. I believe uh, is the yes. name of the mini set. Yes. These are orangutans, and these are not selling as well as the Ginter ones. But again, these are just Goodwin regular ones. Goodwin. Yeah. Sorry, the Ginter ones are just. Uh, regular mini insert. <clears throat> How about the Bachelor's Grove Cemetery near Chicago? Should we go visit it during the night? Maybe yeah, we should. Totally should. Spooky. Do a bo Ginter box break there, there at midnight? I don't think so, no. man, but you might. <laughs> <laughs> How about Copernicus? Not to be confused with okay. uh, Doc, Dr. Emmett Brown's dog in one of the back ah. of the future movies. Nice relic card. They took one of his fitness films and cut frames out of it, and your relic is a piece of film. Not an different. expensive card, but I'll pick one up eventually. Yeah, it's, it's different. Here's another evolutionary card. The hominid doya. <laughs> one of the A's. I got Australopithecus. I think I pronounced that right. You probably got it. Yeah, go. that's not bad. That's a critical that's a cool one. Card. I took biology, but frankly, I couldn't spell it, let alone say it. So Yeah. Here's another one. Maybe this one will end up in the trap. Physical anthropology. Uh -oh. type Ryan Dempster, Jersey. It's a note on some of the bats and Jersey guys with dual. It looks Nick like Switcher some of them. Both, yeah, it looks like example. some of them are tougher. One mm -hmm. of them, you know, just based yep. on market information. I'm Tops not, hasn't. Uh, I'm not saying which Swisher is tougher because I need to corner the market for on both of them. I mean, I got two of one and one of the other, so watch out. You know. Yeah, some of them are tougher, but they're not selling for much of a premium no, if at all. all. You know, maybe one level higher on the tougher version. How about a Tonto Mini? I needed that. Did you need that? I no, that. I did not need no? that. I need Anthony Bourdain instead of Tonto. Yeah, I I'll, agree. I'll, I'll, I'll trade for, for Bourdain. If you're into sports movies, there might be an upcoming issue of Beckett Sports Card Monthly that you love. But that's all I'm going to say about that. Stiff Mickey Ryan. Ward, a movie. Oh, yeah, there you Boxer go. Boxer Mickey Ward, played by Marky Mark. I mean, Mark Wahlberg. Autograph? This, this is a card where it's like... Thanks, but I didn't win. I got a relic, but it's yes. an Aramis Ramirez. If you get three of those in a box, I'm not happy. You get something good and two of those, I'm okay. You're okay with that. And I beat the odds and got an autograph. Not the best autograph, but it's an autograph. <laughs> Andres Torres of the Giants. How okay. about... Those are tough pulls. A free-running and parkour champion, Timothy Schiff. 
I don't know how to say that correctly, but they're getting at. But I bet his autographs are cheap. I, man, maybe. I don't remember. I'm going to get for tops. Oh, okay. Ooh, ah, ooh, shot. Troy Tulowitzki mini. Two birds, standard. Ooh, wow. This pack is huge. It's like way big. Give me a comparison. Like, well, it just, it's just way more dense. <clears throat> I don't know. I can't. I can't. Yeah, look at that. Okay. Here well, we go. Let's talk more open. Let's talk more open. Let's see what it is. Watch, it's a booklet card. Maybe. <clears throat> It'd be a first for us. Speaking of booklets, I did pull this a couple. 15% off an Allen and Ginter binder. It's, it's got two hits in it. Okay. Two frame minis in one pack. Yay! Okay, so I'm just going to go down the pack here. This is a manufacturing faux pas. Vernon oh. Wells, Zach Britton, Lindsay. Oh, yes, how about a Baldo Jimenez Silk out of 10. An evolution card and a Mark Reynolds relic in the same pack. And to prove that this pack was uber loaded, Ugh. the last card in the pack was Nick Swisher, the pride of Parkersburg, West I Virginia. I would complain to Tops and send the whole pack back. Oh, oh no. But I would have liked a Swisher Silk, a Swisher relic, and a Swisher card mm -hmm. instead, but. I'll keep my Hope Solo pack. Wow, that's, that, that might be the most controversial pack in Box Busters history. <laughs> okay. There's a card. There's a card that is actually selling well for base cards. Pack the punch. Yeah. Uh, wah, wah, wah. Pack. Go to the National Sports Collectors yeah, Convention so next week bring it in up. Chicago. There you go. Bring this card to the Beckett grading booth and marvel at Joe Clemens' uh, appearance uh, there. I'm going to ask him for an autograph on camera, by the way. Speaking of Marvel. I'm going to get him to sign uh, one of these and film it. Good Because that's him. Can't okay. deny it, but it's him. It looks Stan like Stan Lee giving the heavy metal sign. He also signed autographs and has relics. He does. It's Batman stuff. Or not Batman. It's uh, Spider-Man stuff. I know. Oh. Whoa. Marvel like DC the Universe. I know. Terrium? Or a sanatorium, is it spelled there? Oddly. Here's your third chef. Yes. Mark Fargione, right? Yes. Uh, new, the newest Iron Chef. So he's the guy that takes the squid that's alive and packs it up while it still moves on the well, table. Not as if not that's the ingredient. If that's the ingredient. No. Right. That's the freakiest thing I've ever seen on television. Or the lobster that's still Moving. running away. And... Okay. I'm trying to sort here. <coughs> I'm out of water. <coughs> oh, well. Dude. I got a key deer mini. A deer mini. Deer. I also got a lion earlier, but I didn't show it. Here's my next hit. So my fourth hit in this box. But first, a Shawn Michaels. Oh. The barber. And a John nice. McEnroe. Both autograph redemptions, but both selling relatively well. Let's see. My fourth hit in this over-delivering over box is an Andre Ethier. So, Former Oakland A, so I wouldn't be unhappy there. Yeah. But wow, three jersey cards. I got the autograph. I, got, I know. I lucked out. Ichiro. I got Edge. Jason Worth, Edge. Ooh. Not having a good year. <laughs> Thank you, Clay. <laughs> and Tops Allen and Ginter team for including chefs, finally. Schmoozer. No, I still, I've, been, I've been asking for that for years. Well, at least three done. years. No, at least three years. So, but so again, be sure to include Anthony Bourdain yeah, Anthony and Bourdain. maybe Andrew Zimmer. And maybe next yeah, we can do Andrew Zimmer, Zimmer too. Baseball players. Right? There we go. Yeah. Anyway, that is 2011 Top Sound and Ginter. It looks to be as popular as usual. It does. In contention, as always, for what is it, product of the year? I think it is so end. far, honestly. It's pretty strong. So the autographs, pretty the, strong. The, the, the secondary the, market has been huge. Minus on some the of these Ryan hits. Howard. Yeah. But other than that, uh, like I said, it is live on Beckett.com and the OPG. Uh, it will be in the next issue of BSCM, which goes to the printer tomorrow. The next issue of Beckett want, yeah. Baseball. Oh, yeah, the pricing yeah, is the pricing for sure. will be there. Review, so. I don't think it made it. But, yeah, review and pricing. So. <laughs> review online, right? Somewhere? Oh, there's plenty of stuff yeah, online. Exactly. All kinds of fun. Thanks.